Oh, well. So, I said I'd do another election video. And uh, it's, it's, it's a bit late, like a uh, week, week and a half, two weeks, something like that. Although, to be fair, which I always try to be to myself, nothing's happened. Nothing's changed. Um, we're in just, it just been exactly the same situation we were before the second election. Um, same players, same rules, same groups. Uh, with the, with the, the exception that, um, like I said, was going to happen even before the second election, I said the small, smaller, smaller parties are going to get smaller. So we're going to disappear completely and the bigger parties are going to get bigger. The longer this goes on, the, we're going to see this accretion of people around the bigger parties and that's happening. Um, both Likud and Kaholavan picked up, uh, two, uh, projected two seats in the Knesset. And a whole bunch of the smaller parties are just gone. Um, Yamina, uh, the right-wing coalition, is um, has actually gained, gained, projected to gain a seat in the new new par new uh, Knesset, which is actually unexpected because they were not doing it not doing it all well in the uh, last couple of elections. But. No one is projected to gain a parliamentary majority. No one will be able to form a government. We're going to end up exactly like we did at the, at the, at the second election and the first election. It's going to be the right-wing bloc, the left-wing and Arabs, and in the middle is going to be Abidor Lieberman. Bibi Netanyahu is not going to make a deal. He needs to stay prime minister to stay out of prison. Benny Gantz is not going to make a deal because he still has... All those internal pressures, all the, the uh, different forces in Kohola Van that he needs to keep in check that, he, that will prevent him from making any kind of deal with Bibi Netanyahu, even if he wants to. And Avidor Lieberman is still a dick. I, I'm still really pissed at the guy for saying he was going to join the right-wing coalition to save us all from a third election and then not doing that. Yeah, still a dick. So, what's probably going to happen is we're going to go into a third stalemate and then a fourth election. You know, even before the, this whole thing, I didn't like Israeli politics. Now, I love the country. I love the people. Can't stand the politics. Even before all this went down. At this point, I'm seriously considering going back to America. I really am, just because, man, this is no way to run a country. Anyway, um, so that's it. A lot of wheel spinning. Um, some smaller parties uh, getting smaller, some vanishing completely, bigger parties getting bigger. And we're going into a third election with probably the same, res the exact same results we had last two. I should silly hope that something that something does happen. Maybe, maybe Netanyahu steps down from the Likud for whatever reason. Um, some miracle happens, and uh, Kahola Van bends some on something. Uh, Abido Lieberman might might stop being a dick. You know, stranger things have happened. This is Israel, land of miracles. So, if you pray, please pray for us, because we need all the help we can get. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, thanks for thanks for uh, listening to me. If you if you uh, want to hear more, please like, share, comment, subscribe, and uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.